So we've discovered the benefits of the Navigator panel, but do we really want it right in the middle of the screen? It's no doubt going to conceal something in our artwork that we really need to edit. So it would be handy if we could move it. And we can, if you hover your cursor over the dark bar across the top of any panel that floats on screen, you can click and hold down the left mouse button and drag and move that around. Whilst ever the left mouse button's held down, you can reposition that somewhere out of the way so you can focus on your artwork. If you find that the window that is the preview in here is too small, you can then take your cursor to the bottom right hand side of that panel. When the scale symbol reveals on screen, click and hold down the left mouse button once more and drag away from the upper left side, dragging away in there. When you let go of the mouse, the thumbnail will update on screen, but larger. Now you can make this a good deal bigger. The only thing to bear in mind is that the bigger this preview is, the less efficient it's going to be because it's going to occupy so much room. So again, you could take your cursor over to the bottom right corner and drag and pull it back up as far as you can to get it to its smallest size possible. If you wish to just tuck it out of the way because you don't need it for a few minutes, you can head up to the upper right hand side where you can collapse it to icon mode with a left click on the two little arrows. Now, technically this is an icon mode. It's really sort of a button mode. So we see a symbol as every panel does have a symbol and then the name of the panel. When you left click, the panel pops open, do what you need inside of there. And when you're done, click on that button to make it disappear. If you wish to make it really small, hover your cursor over the far right edge of that panel. When you see the scale symbol again, click and hold down the mouse and drag to the left hand side to shrink that back to just icon mode. Obviously you'll need to be able to remember what those symbols mean, but when you click on them, they do the same thing. They pop open on screen when you're done, click away from them inside of there. If you need to see that again, with all the options visible, go back up to the two arrows at the top to expand panels and you'll see everything you need inside of that panel. In a future video, I'll show you how you can tuck that navigator panel and dock it to the side of the screen. Some of that's out of the way of your artwork, but very easy to find and utilize.